Workforce Windsor Essex is your local employment planning council, supporting workforce development initiatives across the city of Windsor and all the communities in the county of Essex. Since December 2015, the team's been working on completing a number of projects, all aimed at getting quality, timely, and relevant labor market information into the hands of Windsor and the Essex County community. The municipality of Leamington proudly supports and is an active participant in employment planning activities. Workforce Windsor Essex, by providing research and resources to assist employers, job seekers, service providers, local agencies, educational institutes, government, students, and the communities we serve at large is a source and expert in local labor market information. This video will showcase what the team's been up to over the last year and a half. So let's get started. On October 7th, we brought 750 students from 13 schools and four school boards out to tour local manufacturing companies. 23 employers opened their doors so that students could gain a better understanding of our local manufacturing industry. Students engaged with staff and asked questions throughout the tours, in addition to participating in interactive activities on the shop floors. During lunch, all students gathered together to hear further from local employers and to learn more about the Ontario Youth Apprenticeship Program. We have received excellent feedback from all stakeholders who were involved in this initiative. On November 10th, we encourage young women to build a dream. 626 young female students with their parents gathered to interact with 48 employers and 50 local mentors in learning more about career opportunities where women are underrepresented. Participants heard from women who have experience in these industries and connected with employers to learn more about in-demand careers in local companies. This event included a daytime symposium where 122 employers and stakeholders gathered to learn the importance of a diversified workforce. Stay tuned for details on Build a Dream 2017, coming to Windsor, Essex this November. Your job search was developed as a result of research on barriers that people face when searching for employment. It has population-specific job search tips for newcomers, people on Ontario Works, persons who are underemployed, and recent post-secondary graduates. There is also helpful information on making the most of job fairs, a guide to labour market information, and local employment service success stories. Our goal through this project is to connect job seekers with the services and supports that they need when looking to secure employment opportunities. Your job search is a great booklet. It includes all the steps a job seeker requires to lead them to success. This guide gives the reader a look into local employment services that connect job seekers with work. Part of putting this guide together involved us touring and hosting consultations with these organizations and their clients. From these experiences, we were able to gain the perspective of local services from staff, employers, and job seekers. This report highlights our findings, best practices, and recommendations. Workforce Windsor Essex, the region's local employment planning council, has launched a new online tool called WeSearch that makes the process of researching business funding opportunities as well as employment services and or upgrading programs easier than ever. By answering a few questions about the kind of help a user is looking for, WeSearch presents information about organizations, programs, and or services that match their needs, utilizing a free, easy to use wayfinding tool that is available in both Anglais and Francais. WeSearch simplifies the task of researching programs and services so that businesses and job seekers can focus on what matters most, growing their business or finding that next job. With the plans announced for the Gordie Howe International Bridge, we were interested to learn what jobs will be needed in the development, design, and construction of such a historic and significant infrastructure project. We spoke to employers, educational partners, and training institutions to learn more about key occupations in the construction and skilled trades. Help Bridger City captures these occupations and their required skills. We look forward to learning more as the project plans continue so we can inform and update our community on these important jobs. The term skills gap is something that has been heard in the news, mentioned by employers, and referenced as a barrier to employment. 
We want to introduce community definitions that create a better awareness of gaps by grouping skills into three categories, foundational skills, technical skills, and soft skills. We've gathered information on the most in-demand jobs by examining job posting information and comparing it with insight from employers to identify the top 50 in-demand skills in our region. We created a matrix of these jobs indicating the skills and experience needed, the median wage, as well as the level of education required for each. This resource will demonstrate the needs of local employers while also providing guidance and advice to job seekers. The results of the quarterly survey allow me to see a true and current glimpse into our region, a picture of our workforce, along with recruitment challenges and industry trends. It's a fantastic human resources tool to utilize and present to management, especially when faced with a shortage of skilled labor and industry-specific jobs in our area. I also think it's a great resource for high schools, colleges, universities, and students to comprehend industry and employer needs in the area, pointing them in the right direction as to what is in high demand in Windsor, which in turn drives Windsor's employment rate and economy. Transportation has been identified as a barrier to employment. Job seekers who do not have reliable transportation are often limited in terms of the employment opportunities they can access. Employers located beyond public transit routes have indicated that growing their workforce is challenging because of the inability for potential employees to access their facility through transportation. We examine job posting information to identify where concentrations of jobs are within our community and use mapping technology to visually represent the data. This gives us the ability to look at changes over time in terms of volumes of postings, types of jobs, and employers who are regularly and actively recruiting. The activities and projects highlighted in this video demonstrate the variety of work and expertise of Workforce Windsor-Essex. This work would not be possible without generous funding from the Ministry of Advanced Education and Skills Development. Additionally, the central planning table, working groups and community stakeholders' active engagement were instrumental throughout this pilot initiative to ultimately improve how labour market information is collected and shared. Looking ahead, Workforce Windsor-Essex is committed to continuing their work and driving local change through their expertise. We look forward to the opportunities in the future and appreciate the commitment and dedication as we as a Windsor-Essex region look to build and sustain a world-class workforce.